Hi guys, I wanted to come on here and do a get to know me tag. It's not really a tag, but it's just a few questions that I wanted to answer. But I just found some questions online of things to get to know me. I kind of want to look back upon this and be like, oh, do I still like the same things or do I still have the same mind thoughts? What am I talking about? I just do this because I feel like I would want to know this in the future about myself because I tend to forget a lot of things about myself, unfortunately. I feel like if I looked back on this video, I would really enjoy it and for myself, you know. But it's also a cool video um, for you guys to get to know me. I know I don't have like tons of subscribers or anything like that, but um, this is more just a video for me and for anybody who is interested in seeing a video about me. And there are 25 questions, so let's just get right into it. What is your middle name? Now, this sucks because I don't have one. I don't have a middle name, and I don't know why I don't, but I guess my parents didn't care to give me one. Like, my brother doesn't have one either. Um, but sometimes when people do ask me, like, in, in an informal way, like, oh, what's your middle name? I was like, oh, I don't have one, but I have a Vietnamese name. And sometimes people use their Vietnamese name as their middle name, but I don't personally. Like, it's not legally in the papers. But um, my Vietnamese name is Thuy Thiang, and my whole name is Crystal Lamb, but that's it. Like, I don't have a middle name. It makes it more simple for me. <laughs> what was your favorite subject at school? Now, if we were to talk about high school, I would definitely say math. Um, I loved math, and even though I couldn't do, um, was it calculus, AP calculus, I couldn't do it. I, like, pretty much failed that AP test. I absolutely loved that subject, um, not calculus in general, but math in general. Um, I just loved it, and I always excelled at it when I was in high school. Now, if I was to talk about college, um, I did major in chemistry, so I did a lot of chemistry type of things, which I do, and I did enjoy, but I feel like maybe it's not my, like, favorite subject. But if I were to choose a favorite subject, it would have been math. And I was a math major for, I think, a year, either six months or a year. I can't remember, to be honest with you. So, um, but I was a math major when I first came into college, and I did enjoy it while I was. What is your favorite drink? Now, it might be a really bad drink, but I absolutely love soda. There's ones I don't like, but the ones I do like for sure is Mountain Dew. I love Mountain Dew. Now, I know that for myself, I should probably back off the soda, but I can't help it, and I really love soda. My favorite drink would probably have to be Mountain Dew. Um, what is your favorite song at the moment? I really like that song, um, Pillow Talk by Zayn. You'll fall in love with it as, you know, you hear this little snippet of it. But pretty much I thought it was Chris Brown when I first heard it, and I was like, yeah, this sounds like Chris Brown. And then when the chorus came around, I was like, okay, this ain't Chris Brown. Holy crap, it has 107 million views on, on YouTube. And of course, you gotta go through this ad. I love to hold you close tonight and always. I love to wake up next to you. But I absolutely love that song. What kind of sucked was so I was with my friends and I was like, guys, this is like my jam right now. So I played it, um, and then I thought it was uh, in the bed all dirty, which I'm thinking a little dirty, but that's what it sounds like. My friend looked up the lyrics and it says a bed all day, and I'm like. What a fail. It went from like a good lyric to like a, uh, how is that attractive? Honestly, I don't, I don't want to be in the bed all day. I want to go be pro productive with my life and go do something and not just be in the bed all day. Question is, what is your favorite food? Hands down, chicken. Oh my God, I love chicken. I love fried chicken, rotisserie chicken, grilled chicken. Not so much grilled chicken. Crispy chicken, uh, chicken wings. Chicken tenders, chicken nuggets. What is the last thing you bought? Oh, I mean, I last bought a movie ticket. Um, I went to go see How to Be Single with my cousins, and it was actually really funny. Um, it was more of a chick flick, though, because the way it comes off on, like, previews is that it's, like, a, like just a comedy, and it's just, like, something to laugh at. 
but it's very chick flicky because there's like a lot of like love scenes and like weird things that guys probably wouldn't be interested in but I was I really liked it favorite book of all time I don't have a favorite book to be quite honest I hate reading and as bad as that sounds I hate reading so I don't have a favorite book favorite color my favorite color is blue and it has always been blue and this room right here actually used to be light blue like a sky blue and I really liked it but I grew up a little bit and I like changed it there was a phase where I was like I, I don't know if you guys remember this but there was like a phase where uh pink and brown was like the shit like everybody loved that that little combo right there um but then I decided to grow up a little bit, I think this was in high school, and I got uh, white and gold, which I am freaking like proud of myself for liking that because I love it still. Like I love the white and gold. Do you have any pets? And I don't personally, my family does, family, I don't really know. It's my brother's dog. I, but um, anyway, he got a multi-poo. Um, his name is Puma and uh, that was about six years ago. He's sleeping right now and I really don't want to bother him and he probably is really annoyed at me because I'm just talking to myself. Number 10, favorite perfume. Now, I don't have a favorite perfume, but I do have a favorite cologne. It's called Thallium and it's a guy cologne. Holy shit, it smells amazing. And like, I want that cologne so I could spray it on myself. I did try the women version because I thought it would be quite similar. Mm -mm, I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. So favorite holiday. My favorite holiday. I don't know what my favorite holiday is. I like a lot of holidays. I want to say maybe Christmas if I were to choose like a legit holiday. Um, maybe Christmas because I just like the whole family gathering and um, exchanging gifts and eating food and stuff like that and just really enjoying your family's presence. Presence. <laughs> what a pun. But yeah, presence as in their presence, not their present, you know? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, okay. I like choke on my own breath all the time. Why do I feel so stuffy right now? Next question is, are you married? And heck no, I ain't not married. Homegirl ain't not married. I have a boyfriend and I've been dating him for uh, three and a half years and it's been awesome. But we think of marriage, but not anytime soon. Okay, have you ever been out of the country? If so, how many times? Yes, I've been out of the country. I've been to Canada. I went to Canada and as a little kid and I don't remember anything from it except that everybody spoke French and I didn't understand. But I've also been to Cancun, Mexico uh, and that was this past summer, which was awesome. It was my uh, graduation gift from my uncle, which I actually really appreciate and I had a good time and I got really tan, so. Do you speak any other language? Um, if we're talking fluently, no, um, but broken, very broken. I do speak Vietnamese a little bit and I understand more than I speak. 15, how many siblings do you have? I have one sibling and it is a brother. It is a brother. <laughs> but yeah, I love my brother. Um, he's, I'm actually super close to him, which I am grateful for because honestly, like as much as I want a sister, I'm just glad I ha even have a sibling and, um, I think he's totally awesome, even though we bicker sometimes, but that's what brothers and sisters do. What is your favorite shop? Um, if we're talking like clothing, I would say Forever 21, uh, but as of lately, it has not been my favorite store. The way they like display their clothes, it's really annoying and I don't like it. As of right now, I think Ross and Homegirl is balling on a budget for real. And this shirt, by the way, oh my god, my bra. This shirt, by the way, is from Ross, and it's totally awesome. It's like a sweater material. It feels awesome. I don't really know what material this is, but it's got, like, this shoulder action going on, and then it's, like, a mini turtleneck, which I have never been into, by the way, but I've been seeing it a lot lately. I'm not quite sure what this is called, like, a mini turtleneck, um, but girls have been working it, and I was like, let me try that. It's long sleeve. It looks nice. Like, I could dress this up and dress this down. That's how versatile this is. Favorite restaurant. Uh, there's no, like, restaurant that is, like, a go-to. I just have, like, moods and like cravings and those all just differ when was the last time you cried about a week ago i'm trying not to reference to that song i'm gonna hold back hold back crystal hold back long story short i uh walked out of my job and that was due to my manager being a little bit rude uh i am very sensitive so 
last time was a week ago and favorite blog I don't know if I have a favorite blog because I don't follow anybody I do have a lot of Instagram people that I love I don't know if that even counts but pretty much like all the makeup girls on YouTube I love them all favorite movie um, favorite movie um, that I've seen recently has been Deadpool it was just so funny um, if you've seen the movie, the movie already um, I don't want to do any spoiler alerts but pretty much like um, if you see the movie when they reference to like the whole um, I can't remember exactly what they said but it was something about like girlfriends like their, your boyfriends bringing you to this movie and like you just think it's like another action movie but it's like I don't know just that line whatever they're talking about I was just like laughing because I was like really able to relate to that favorite tv shows <sighs> hands down the bachelor <laughs> bachelor bachelorette um or anything dealing with bachelor um it's like kind of one of my guilty pleasures I don't know who he's gonna end up with but if I were to choose, like, right now at this moment, possibly Kayla. Another one of my favorite shows is Teen Mom OG, the original Teen Mom Girls. I actually don't care for the, any of the other Teen Moms. Macy was my favorite Teen Mom, like, for the longest time, which she still is. Uh, my favorite couple is uh, Caitlin and Tyler. They're so cute together. Question number 22, almost done here. PC or Mac? I just recently got a Mac, and so I would say I'm a Mac person. My Mac has been treating me so well. I've had it for like maybe two months already and I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. I don't regret my purchase. Good purchase, good investment. And yes, I Mac all the way, even though I still don't really know how to use it, but I'm getting there. What phone do you have? Okay, cool. I have an iPhone. <laughs> I now have an iPhone and once again, I'm super happy with it. <laughs> How tall are you? I am 5'5". Five, five. I'm taller than your average Asian chick. Last question, can you cook? That's a weird last question to have because it doesn't really close off anything. Unfortunately, I mean like I can cook but I don't know a lot of things to cook. Um, I hope you really enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed doing it. I actually really enjoyed doing it. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you like this type of video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye!